Praise God, praise God. I do apologize. I'm getting back on here. They're messing with my feed again, but y'all know how it is. All right, so after the conference on Monday night, we will be baptizing those that want to be baptized. Praise God. This is the address. Praise God. Hallelujah. We'll be baptizing people in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. All right, so I want to talk about baptizing. All right, it's water baptism. Water baptism is a test of obedience. It is the circumcision of the heart which takes away our spiritual uncleanness. But the key verse is, Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, for the remission of sins, and ye shall receive the gift of of the Holy Ghost. Come on, somebody. Can anybody hear me? Can y'all hear me? Can y'all see me? When I, I know y'all can't see me, but can you hear me? Praise God. Hallelujah. You know, they've been messing with my lives. Um, <laughs> praise God. So um, this is what water baptism is. We will be baptizing people at the conference. I'm going to say that again. At the conference, the Vision of God conference, which is on Monday from 5.30 to 9.30 p.m., we will be baptizing those that want to be baptized. Water baptism. Praise God. Praise God. So let me continue. I'm going to repeat this. The key verse is water baptism is a test of obedience. It is the circumcision of the heart which takes away our spiritual uncleanness. Then the key verse is, then Peter said unto them, repent and be baptized Every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sins and get this one. Listen very closely and you should receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. I think so many times that people are just, you know, they go up to the altar and that's good, but you have to do the whole steps. Come on somebody. Hallelujah. Jesus teaching on baptism is this. It says in Giving the commission to the apostles, Jesus clearly stated that in order to be saved, a man would have to be, have to believe and be baptized. He that believeth and is baptized should be saved, but he that believeth not should be damned. That's Mark 16, 16. Come on somebody. Hallelujah. So I just want you guys to know that we will be baptizing, um, after the conference. Um, so that's just something sure that you bring a, a change of clothes and that you're presentable. All right. So this is Apostle Deanna 